Today we will design this table fan front grill. You can see it. In this, you will see how to create these axles and how to create this IC symbol using this wrap feature. Okay. So first of all, I have opened here a new part. Then we have to select here right plane, sketch. Here I will select one line. Draw one vertical line like this. Then you can see once we come to this point, it will convert into an arc. Draw an arc like this and right click and then select. So now we'll select this line and select this arc. Here we'll make it tangent. Okay. Same as it is, you can see this arc is tangent to this line. Here you can see a tangent symbol. Now let's assign some dimensions to this so that I'll select your smart dimension, select this point and this origin point. Give this vertical distance 320 mm. Okay. This distance we have to give 200 mm. This radius will be 75 mm. This point to this point, this vertical distance of the line, it will be 75 mm. Okay. Just right click and then select. So now again select one line. From here, draw one horizontal line like this and then vertical. Right click select. Next, select here fillet. Give here radius 6 mm. Select this point. OK. And again, select this point. This time, give here radius 3 mm. OK. Close it. My diameter. Now, let's select this line and this line. This horizontal distance will be 12 mm from this line to this point. This vertical distance we have to give 15 mm. So now let's go to features and select here swept boss rate. Select a circular profile. Then select this sketch. Once we select it, we have to give here diameter. So diameter this will be 2 mm. Then just select OK. As you can see, now we will select here front plane and then sketch. OK. So as you can see this edge is shown here. So we have to select this edge and select convert entity. So as we have selected a front plane, you will see here a flat line. Control plus one for the front view. And you can see this line is here. Now let's select one circle. Let's draw one circle on this line and make this tangent to this line. Okay. Now select smart dimension. Select this circle. This diameter will be 180 mm. Right click and then select. F button to the fit screen mode. Now just select this point and the center point. Select these two points and make it vertical. And you can see it is fully defined. Now you have to select this line. Select this line and make it for construction and OK. Now just go to features and select extruded bus space. Extrude distance we have to give 20 mm here. OK. That's it. Now select this back side face. Sketch. Here select convert entities, 
select this space okay now select top set entities and we have to select this edge reverse direction and offset it 20 mm okay now just select this edge and make it for construction okay now select features and extruded cut give your extrude distance 5 mm 5 mm is not enough let's give here 8 mm okay so 8 mm is sufficient now we have to circular pattern this axle so that we have to show here axis so you can see the axis of this circle is shown now just select here circular pattern and in the direction we have to select this axis and in the feature select this axle once you select it we have to give here numbers give here 52 numbers 360 degree we have to keep here then just select ok ok now you can see then just hide this axis this axis also ok now just select here fillet select this edge give here 7 mm ok now select again fillet select this inside edge and outside edge give this both 5 mm ok so now we have to select a right plane then sketch here from the sweep you can see this sketch show it here and you can see it is shown here ok let's select convert entity and convert this point ok now here let's draw one circle mark dimension and give this circle a diameter of 10 mm right click and then select press F for the fit screen now from here select show access exit this sketch now select revolved boss space the axis of revolution we have to select here this central axis so sketch is already selected and you can see in the preview it is revolved ok ok now just again hide this axis again hide this sketch ok so now we will select here front plane sketch so now here we will draw a circle so that select here circle and from here select this center point draw a circle like this smart dimension and give this circle diameter 621 enter then we will go to features and select here the boss circular profile will select here then select this circle and give your diameter 5 mm and then just select ok now you can see yes it's perfect so now again select a front plane sketch here again draw one circle from this center point like this smart dimension and give this circle diameter 420 mm enter same as it is go to features and select sweat for space circular profile then select this circle give your diameter 5 mm 
ओके सो नाउ यू कैन सी अवर फ्रंट फ्रंट ग्रिल इज रेडी सो नाउ ऑन दिस पेज वी जस्ट हैव टू क्रिएट अवर आईसी लोगो यूजिंग द रैप फीचर सो फॉर दैट वी हैव टू सिलेक्ट दिस पेज कैच ओके हियर लेट्स ड्रॉ वन सेंटर लाइन Travel line like this here, horizontal. Right click, select. Okay. Now select here one text. In the curve, we have to select the center line. Give here text. I see. Okay. Then from here, you can see center line, right align options. So here we will select center align. Bold we have to select here, and you can see I see is shown here. You here you can see it is click on the document font. We will uncheck this, and from the font we will increase its size. So from here font we will select Times New Roman. This make it bold. And give your fifty mm, okay, okay, perfect. So fifty mm is okay, and you can see it is aligned as per the circle. Yes, it is looking fine. So select here, okay. Now let's exit the sketch features, and we have to select here wrap. In this. You have to select your emboss and this wrap, line surface. Okay, so this sketch is already selected. You just have to select this space. You can see in the preview, it is embosses. It's emboss on this space. Then you can, if you want, you can increase its accuracy. I'm also increasing it. Then just select OK here. so you can see its ic logo is created here then just we have to give a color to this so that i'll select inside of this i and inside of this c and select here yellow color you can see it's giving to this only let's okay it then select this c symbol appearance give this also yellow color okay so we have applied color to the both of this ic symbol so now we will apply color to this front grill for that we will select here edit appearance and select here color you can choose this and uh, this one is perfect okay and you can see let me change its appearance to the Three point five eight. Okay. So you can see our front grill is ready, and it looks perfect. So that's it in this video. I hope you like this tutorial. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe us. Thanks for watching.